the kind of the contributions come from different companies that have um, and also individuals that have different interests right so trying to provide some sort of focus point where they can all work together on something and find common grounds for what they want to achieve is always challenging with companies from different different parts of the world that also they tend to compete on the same market so so we are, we are about to release the, the first, uh, well, we, we are releasing now the, set, the first Symbian uh, release that comes from the foundation directly. So the, this means that the source is open for members and we're building it from the foundation. And you, know, you can then go download it for free, basically, and, mm -hmm. and start making products and applications out of it. So uh, that's something we work in and we kind of very close to get to something where we'll call, you know, we do a baseline, we call it by. You know, it's a great news because it means you know, we can really start getting your hands dirty on what you want Symbian application Symbian phones. Um, so within the open source environment, I guess the difference to a proprietary environment is kind of you always think of project managers as someone to have a group of people and you drive them to a delivery date and you kind of normally uh, perceive as the guy with the big stick beating people up to make sure you made the deadlines. And, within an open source uh, environment really is much more about facilitating people to contribute and come together so we still have a plan to meet and we still have uh, quality criteria we need to meet and the, the way to do that is by focusing the, the industry and the uh, contributors into what's the highest importance for, for all of them you know so find that common ground and make sure we can deliver on time and then help facilitating communication so it's much more a facilitated role so you know no sticks, more bigger carrots, that's that sort of approach. So it's, it's great to work in the Symbian Foundation. So uh, we have a very diverse culture. Uh, we have uh, teams that are focused around um, the technology and the marketing, but ultimately it's just fairly open on how we go about things. So you have people from different walks of, of life and backgrounds that kind of meet together uh, every Friday for drinks and kind of exchange. We used to try to avoid the HR team that yeah. trying to take notes. But a part of that, uh, it's really, it's really good. Really. It's, it feels as open internally and the way that we do business as we are open externally with our technology. So if you want to get started, you can do it now. You can start playing with the code. So you can go to our developer website, developer.simi.org, and register and start accessing code. If you really want to get seriously dirty hands on it, then you can also join as a member of the foundation. Uh, as I said, we already have uh, stuff for you available to download and start uh, producing either phones or applications or whatever you want to do. Um, and we are here to help. So it's a whole host of people in the foundation that can help you get started. So the best way to start is on our developer website.